This is a basic shark, and it eats basic fish, and it's watched by basic viewers. It can even eat other sharks as long as they're small. Jellyfish kind of give it a sting. Oh, what about- Nope. Okay, those don't work. But after that little run, we're level 3, get our rewards. That means we can level up our bite and our speed just a little bit. Then we're also going to make our bite better, and also our speed. And now we're slightly more dangerous, and this is just the beginning. There's a turtle and some crabs. My favorite breakfast. Not really sure particularly what it is I'm supposed to be eating, so I'm just going to put everything in my mouth and hope for the best. And that's really what life is all about. Putting things in your mouth and hoping for good results. I ran into a few sharks so far. Oh, there's a diver. My first person. Okay, I need to remember not to put the spiky things in my mouth. Oh, a sea mine. But that was worth $170, and that could be a lot of upgrades. Or, for only 25 emeralds, we could become a mako shark, which is 4.6 meters long. So I just need to find a way to earn some gems. Do we think 2,000 is going to be enough? Don't let your kids watch! I wasn't really sure, so I bought 4,000. Holy crap! He eats the fish that are trying to eat themselves and sea pancakes. And since we have some coins, we can definitely upgrade it right away, so we want extra bite and speed. So let's put this bigger, badder shark to use. Small fish are okay, sea mines are not. Smaller sharks, definitely edible. What about an obnoxiously large boat? Can we eat some of that? It seems we cannot, but if I get on top of it, I might be able to get the sailor? Not a sailor, he's a fisherman. Whatever the case, they're all edible. Probably shouldn't eat those. Unless they're very, very small, because those are the most tender. Okay, I can't eat a hammerhead shark because I need a bigger shark, but I probably can annoy him. Never mind. So let's make our bite just a little bit stronger. I never really realized you could buy coins, so... Is 200,000 going to be enough? I'm going to go with probably, but I bought 200,000 coins, so now our little shark is going to get a little bit more intimidating. Maximum upgrades, and we have 195,000 coins left over, so those actually go kind of fast. Considering this is realistically still just a baby shark who can't even eat sea mines. Ooh, a lady. Get, Get in my, my mouth, mouth. Both, both of you. you. We'll use a bit of boost. A golden man. I'm pretty sure I can hop on land. Yep, perfectly normal. Come here. Just one step. Clear. Yeah, gotcha. That lady was not taking that seriously enough. But no one expects a man-eating shark to come to their beach. So I'm pretty sure that was a shark we started as. We're able to eat those fairly easily. Still getting some trouble from other things though, like the lionfish. And we got a gold rush, and I think that just turns every fish into gold, so that means extra money for me. Now I can't find any fish. I do think I hear a boat. Nope, it's the hovercraft thing. Okay, well, we can eat parachuters too, because why wouldn't we be able to eat parachuters? Ooh, what is that? What is this? Oh. I was just thinking that 4,000 emeralds wasn't enough. Touched another sea mine, so those are getting annoying. Okay, this is where things are going to start to frustrate me. I'm just kidding. We died, so we need a bigger shark. Next would be the hammerhead shark for 60 emeralds. I think we're going to skip over that and go to tiger shark. It is 200 emeralds, but I've got time. 6.5 meters long. And perhaps more importantly, it can eat puffer fish. We're going to test out the base model before we decide whether or not it's worth an upgrade. And um, it gets jellyfished pretty hard, so I don't know if it's worth the upgrade. These idiots have to earn their improvements. But we'll see how it handles against all these other fish. Sea mines are still a problem. Going to make a mental note of that. Probably need to stop touching jellyfish and sea mines, but aside from that, this shark is pretty good. And we can make it hit orbit. I wonder if we get a bonus or make it hit the moon. Okay, that's a hammerhead which we could have unlocked. I'd rather just eat it. Along with all of these rather large fish over here. Wow, these gotta be worth a lot of points. Okay, we already have a submarine harassing us. Uh, that does a lot of damage, so we're not big enough to take on the submarine yet. Things are so much dangerous over here to the right. But all the divers get pushed straight into my mouth, right where I want them. Whoop, don't touch that. Okay, I might have touched it a little bit, but we survived. Ooh, pancakes. Oh, and divers. And other sharks. And a swimmer in a cage. Ow. Everything wants to eat me. I need a bigger shark so I can be more intimidating. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, a donut. Wait, let me go. I gotta eat the donut. Now I can eat you, baby seal. Two baby seals. And another diver. So far, this is my best performing shark uh, because it's pretty tough and can eat a lot more things. Like even these guys, before those would have devoured me, now they can be eaten. Can we get to these guys? Guys, you want to come out here for a sec? Ah, I'll come back for those guys with a bigger shark. And I found a submarine again. We're going to have to avoid that for now because I'm not big enough. Just going to enjoy my scuba snacks and move on with my day. Stop. Thank you. It's kind of like get in the boat, but instead it's my mouth. There's got to be something good over here because I had to get through a bunch of sea mines to get here. Well, we got a teddy bear, which I'm sure is something fun. 
Oh good, I found the submarines again. We need a bigger shark. While the shark is pretty good, we only made it to level 2. We do get lots of coins though. So after the tiger shark comes the great white shark. After that we get the megalodon. And once you get into this range, it makes you start buying each and every one along the way to unlock them. So we're going to un unlock the Great White, it's 8.5 meters long, but then we're going to skip over that because that's boring and get a Megalodon, which is like a super Great White. 14.5 meters long, it eats entire boats and sea mines. And that costs 900 emeralds, which is actually a lot of money. So we'll give it just a few upgrades because it is a Megalodon after all. This already feels better, look how big we are. The turtles look so small now. The turtles used to be like the size of us. Now they're the size of our eyeballs. Bigger sharks are so much easier. I don't really have to try and do anything. I just swim around and stuff gets in my mouth automatically. Look how small the people are now. Hi guys. Beach is closed today. Uh, the swordfish can still stab me. But I pretty much eat everything ever. So I'm not too worried yet. It might not be the prettiest of sharks. But boy can it eat. Oh another shark. That was easy. We ate Joan 007. And I regret nothing. If I see something, I'm putting it in my mouth. Jellyfish? We can eat the jellyfish, so that's kind of nice. These are always annoying me. Ooh, there's a really big shark down here. What are you? Get in my mouth. Get in my mouth. Thank you. I'm not sure if I earn points for that, but I want it in my mouth. It's a little bit harder to navigate the lava streams, but we'll make do. It's a downside to having a big shark. We're also starving, so there's probably not a lot of food down here, so this might have been a bad choice. I mostly just don't think I can find my way back here, and I don't know what this spot is yet. We got a moon on his stick. Ooh, ooh, look at the size of that thing. What are you? Get in my mouth. We need a bigger shark. I have a big shark right now, but that thing was much bigger. I think this is actually it, Big Daddy. So we'll give Big Daddy a try, 14 meters long, but uh, responsible for the extinction of a megalodon, and it can eat the submarines. And eating submarines has always been a hobby of mine. This is definitely a very, very big shark. We can hardly even fit down this little tunnel, but we don't have to avoid the sea mines anymore. That used to be stressful to try and avoid those. Now we just cruise on through eating them as we go. Not any concern at all. Free points. Okay, these are sharks that are ages ago. They're bigger than the ones I think I started as, but they look very tiny compared to me now. And I'm starving because jellyfish aren't good enough for this guy. But I suppose that makes sense. There's probably not a lot of sustenance in a jellyfish. So if we go left this time, we'll surely find newer things. I mostly just want to eat people. Protein shake. There we go. Look at all these good people. Nice day to go to the beach. Oh, let's go into orbit. How high does this shark go? Just about out of frame. Nice. There's a hammerhead. I don't know if you saw it, but it was pretty small. There's another one. Lots of hammerheads around. They're basically an appetizer. Wait, there's another beach up top. Hi, guys. I just can't resist a good beach day. We're just managing the ecosystem. They can't have too many humans up top. They start to ruin the oceans. I'm going to throw in a couple of sea pancakes. Then we're going to jump up here. Oh, we jumped over some of the people. But we got a boat, and I know how to get the people anyway. We just gotta go back the other way. This is a land shark now. I just realized how much health I lose jumping out of water. Uh, I actually just looked at my health bar for the very first time. So now I know how that works. But my strategy doesn't change. If I see something, it's going in my mouth. That keeps me alive and entertained. Uh, I just ate someone who was a very small shark. Probably a bot. Oh, a submarine. I always wanted to eat one of these. Get in my mouth. Where's my boost? There we go. Not entirely sure what happened, but we ate it. Also, you. Come here, big fella. What is that? It's in my mouth, whatever it is. Not allowed to eat that boat, so let's go this way. Something's happening. Oh, it's a gold rush. Ooh, let's eat that guy. Hi, nice shark. Mine's better. And I obviously very wor worked very hard to get this. I definitely didn't buy it. This thing's a tank, though. It's just going along eating absolutely everything. With no question for what it is. Oh, hello. Don't worry, I put these in my mouth all the time. Gotcha. Oh, a megalodon. Come here. Gotcha. There's so many fun things to eat over here. Stop. Stop. Yeah. Got it. Oh good, more people. Pretty sure, yep, I saw Pinocchio over here. That might actually be a very strong shark. And it was. We got a multi-kill. We got lots of stuff going on there. 678 coins, which is actually really good. But we're going to skip ahead a few steps. We're going to go through Big Daddy, through whatever Mr. Snappy is, Alan, Moby Dick, Leo, Nessie, all the way up to Shark Chira who's normally incredibly expensive, but for only 125 emeralds, we can buy. Shark Jira can dive 300 meters and 15 meters long. I didn't really realize I actually had like achievements I could be doing. We'll see if this massive behemoth is worth the price. We're going to stay up where there's lots of stuff to eat at least at first. 
Pretty sure I can actually go through these now. Yeah, I can bust through the earth itself because I'm that big. I already forgot all of my achievements, so I'm just going to go ahead and eat everything. Actually, I'm pretty sure stomping on people was one of them. And I really like that because we're not even eating them. We're just stomping them for fun at that point. Oh, we got something big. Oh, what are you? Are you a shark Jira? Can I eat you? Leroy Jenkins, gotcha. I think that might have been an achievement to kill other shark Jiras as we see them. But I wouldn't want to overthink a game as complicated as this. I'm just going to start putting things in my mouth and not stop. Oh, I can eat entire diver cages now. And boats, but we crossed that bridge a while ago. Hey, nugget, get in my mouth. It's my goal to be the biggest, baddest, most ridiculous shark in the entire world. I don't care what it takes to get there. There's so many things to eat. I still get completely lost very quickly. Maybe we should try going deeper. There's generally less fish to eat down deeper, but um, I'm pretty sure there's going to be more fun stuff. Definitely ate another emerald fish, and that makes me feel good with its pretty sounds. Okay, you're dead also. I have no idea what happens when another shark shows up like that. Oh, look at all the glowfish. The ocean's going to be so much darker after this. And these feel very expensive to eat. I don't know why. Oh, right. This is where all of these were. Yeah, that's right. This is where my megalodon died for the first time. And that set me on my rampage to this giant ass shark. Just gonna go through the fire because I just don't have time to care otherwise. I need to keep putting things in my mouth. I'll starve before I burn to death. I'm pretty sure of that. Sharks don't like fire. Oh, I think I've unlocked my atomic breath or whatever it is too. Oh, that's kind of fun. I should be using this more. I don't think I really eat anything using this, but I do kill a lot of stuff. And that's really what it's all about. Oh, it's Hungry Tom. Tom, you're lucky you weren't here a second ago. I would have lasered the life out of you. Now I gotta build up my super mouth again. Found another spot for a little feeding frenzy because there's a lot of stuff here. Oh, found another one. I don't have my uh, magic mouth yet, but we almost do now. Monster kill. Uh, submarine. Ow, stop. Okay, you know what? Here. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. Now we're gonna destroy everything in the ocean just because we can. That works pretty well, but I don't love its range because anything out of screen still survived. And I don't want any survivors in the ocean. This is single-handedly supposed to beat my ocean and my ocean only, thanks for the boat. Could someone point me in the direction of a challenge? Because I would really like to find one. There appears to be another spot here. Hello, friend. Would you like my magic mouth? Gotcha. Ludicrous kill. Yeah, you're telling me. I've got a laser mouth. Okay, I also got a dartboard and we have a 120 times multiplier. I'm gonna eat whatever that was and continue to put things in my mouth while going deeper. I'm multitasking now. Have I done any achievements yet? Look how small the divers are compared to us now. We're obnoxiously large. I can't wait to see how much bigger we get. Another dead end, so I'm not really sure where to go from here. I need to find those bigger sharks. I just don't know where they're hiding. I'm torpedo proof, dummy. Oh, more people. Come here, guys. I know this doesn't really benefit me in any way, but it's pretty funny. Whole buildings are going to be collapsed. I could probably honestly just skim back and forth across the surface like this, and nothing would ever go wrong. We just continually eat innocent people. We get some pretty good vertical on this shark, too. Oh, there's another tentacly monster. Okay, we're going to, yeah, magic mouth it. Then we died. So on that one, we got 12,000 coins, which is tons, but Shark Jira didn't even level up. Uh, Abyss Shark is a little bit tempting right now, but we can actually evolve Shark Jira. And it says here that this one can eat the tentacle thing, so for only 1,000 emeralds, we're going to evolve it. I just realized we're already out of emeralds. That's okay, it was totally worth it, because now we're stronger than ever. Those things that managed to damage me before probably can't anymore, because we're Lava Shark Jira. That definitely doesn't sound like something a child made up. But I am going to enjoy this an awful lot. Hey, I found this spot already. Hi, guys. All right, so let's go a little deeper and find something a little bigger. People are fun and all, but they're pretty small. Wait, gotcha. Oh, there's someone. Hi. Bye. I saw the tail of another shark somewhere. He might have seen me and run off. We can go through the portal, though. All right, this sees me somewhere with, like, pina coladas or something. Paraglider. What? I'm not immune to lava? What's the point of lava, shark, if I can't... What? That's stupid. We're going deeper anyway. Stop biting me. I'm bigger than you. The laws of nature state that if I'm bigger than you, you can't bite me. I also assume there's something really cool down here because you gotta go through a lot of fire to get here. But that's a sacrifice I'm willing to put my shark through. I do hear something up top, though, that I'm probably gonna need to put in my mouth. Oh, gold rush. What good timing. Oh, it kicked us out at the wrong time, but now we're definitely a fireball. That was kind of fun. Hey, look. Oh, I missed him. Ooh, we have lava breath now. A long one at that, too. All right, now that we spent a fortune on that shark, what else can we have? Next on the list is Abyss Shark, who's got a big mouth but can eat Shark Jira. Costs 900 emeralds, though, so we're gonna have to buy some more. 
Since we needed a few more emeralds, there's 6,100. So we're going to buy Abyss Shark. But we want to do better, so we're also going to buy the Kraken, which can eat the Abyss Shark. But they were mostly a stepping stone so we could get to the Luminite, who looks to be the biggest, 16.5 meters, 400 meter depth. Upgrades cost an alarming $45,000 each, so that's actually like $150 worth of upgrades right there. So let's give this maniac a test. I even have a blade for a face to show how intimidating I am. This thing is really, really big. Pretty sure it can eat literally anything we're about to run into. And it can go through that, and we have a superpower. Oh, that's kind of interesting. I don't have to aim. And I feel like I could probably use that fairly often. I do like these big sharks though, because they really don't have to be choosy about where they're going. If there's a boulder in the way, they just go straight through. Oh, this person's trying to run away. Bot, whatever it is. They're trying to run, they die. Another one. We gotta get in my mouth. Can I super? Oh, I don't have my power ready. But I'm pretty sure because I've upgraded once that we can defeat those. Because the upgrades are still really expensive. Another one. Superpower. Oh, they seem to know to run away when I do that. But I can still eat them because they have to turn around. Oh, another one. Why are there so many of these here? I mean, I'll eat them. That's no problem. Probably just more points for me. But we clearly found where the big sharks roam. Come here, get in my mouth, Nessie. Come on, you know you want it. Gotcha. The trick is to keep moving. Keep the mouth open and keep moving. So far, I haven't found a single thing that really puts up anything of a fight compared to this. Even the other sharks like this uh, die pretty quickly. Uh, I'm not even sure what that is. Whatever it is, it's dead. Oh, we got a laser head now. I don't know what this is, but I'm going to enjoy it. Yeah, this is what I was looking for the entire time. A giant shark with monster lasers all over it. We're going to see how this shark handles the land. Well, it doesn't walk on its legs, but it doesn't have legs, so I guess that makes sense. Oh, I got my laser head back. I looked away for a second, so I'm not sure what caused this, but I'm just going to sit back and enjoy it. Sometimes you're better off not knowing. Pretty sure I devoured a megalodon a second ago, and that thing was also quite big. Oh, another one of me. Here. Gotcha. That superpower is hard to hit things with, but when it lands... Oh, is that a megalodon? Come here. Get in my mouth. And another one of me. I don't... Yeah, I do have my power. Oh, it didn't work, though. Well, I got both of them dead. Ooh, that was gold, whatever that was, and that turned me into laser face. You know what would be a really kick-ass name? Taser face! I wish I could just do this all the time. This shark really is great. It eats absolutely everything. And it only costs like a grand, so... Ooh, another Nessie. Come here. There we go. You can't stand up to laser face. Nobody can. Um, I didn't really realize there was a door there, but I'm okay with this. I think this is where the crab roams. Yeah, we got the crab. Now, I know there's a way to do this. I just don't know what the way actually is. Come here. I think you gotta attack it, like, when it's swinging. I don't really know. So for that, we didn't level up, but we did earn 14,000 coins. You know, what is interesting, though, is since we evolved Shark Jira, it actually appears farther down the chain than the Luminite. So, in theory, yeah, it can actually eat the Luminite. So he's actually who the strongest shark is. We just need to give him some proper upgrades and that's going to get expensive fast. So basically upgrading his three stats is going to cost $100. So upgrading them fully is probably going to be like $500. There's like $300 on almost 500,000 coins. Hopefully that's enough for a few upgrades. We're going to get extra speed, extra bite, and extra boost. Well, the upgrades don't get so super more expensive but they're just really expensive to begin with so i think we're gonna get it probably up to about this far that's like i don't know hundreds of dollars worth of upgrades but we're definitely gonna be the baddest shark in the ocean especially with our magic mouth i feel like i'm so stupidly quick now like i can't even see what's happening it just everything just gets in my mouth right away no chance to even see what it is yeah i still don't think i've done a single achievement yet Gonna take a quick swim along the surface. Oh, we're here already. I'm even a super quick walker now. Like, the shark just moves really, really quick. Oh, here's someone that wants to fight. Eat lava mouth. I'm not even sure we can really see him, but there was a kraken or something there. So I once again find myself without much of a challenge. A shark like that stands no chance. He doesn't even have glowing... Oh, hello. Yeah, that's definitely a lesser shark, Jira. So I guess this is this shark's version of laser face. And this is okay. It'd be better if I was touching things at the time, but you know what? I can't control these things sometimes. It just happens. Ooh, ooh, Nessie. Yeah, we're gonna have cooked Nessie for dinner. And whatever else happens to be in my vicinity. Oh, another Shark Jira. Come here, I'm super upgraded. Yeah, that's right. I didn't pay all this money for nothing. Probably the good thing these sharks aren't getting any bigger. I'd have to start an OnlyFans. Huh. Well, that's awkward timing. Well, I feel like I've established my dominance as the biggest shark in the history of sharks.